Hi, how you're doing? If your blood type is B, how do you react to nuts and seeds? If you have hit the health roadblock trying to find relief for discomfort or a condition, focusing on the highly beneficial list and eliminating the avoid list from your diet, you can benefit. Try this diet out and in the comments below, write your experience. If you're new to my channel, subscribe, hit the notification bell. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. In the description below, there are links to other videos for your blood type. For now, let's get on with nuts and seeds. The weekly portion size. Nuts and seeds. Weekly portion size for your ancestry. Nuts and seeds, six to eight nuts. If you're African, three to five times. Caucasian, two to five times. Asian, two to three times. Nut butters, one tablespoon. If you're African, two to three times. Caucasian, two to three times. Asian, two to three times. The highly beneficial list. Chinese chestnut, walnut. They increase your microbiome diversity and discourage microbial imbalance. They're good to eat. Walnut enhances carbohydrate metabolism and helps with weight loss. It's good to eat. The neutral list. Almond, almond butter, almond cheese, beech nut, Brazil nut, butternut, carob, chestnut, European, chia seed, flax seed, hemp seed, hickory, lychee, macadamia, pecan, pecan butter, walnut, English, watermelon seed. Among these, almond, almond butter, almond cheese, Butternut, carob, European chestnut, chia seed, flax seed, hemp seed, hickory, macadamia, and pecan butter increases microbiome diversity and discourages microbial imbalance. These are good to eat. The avoid list you need to eliminate. Cashew, cashew butter, filbert hazelnut, peanut, peanut butter, peanut flour, pine nut, pignoli, pistachio, poppy seed, pumpkin seed, safflower seed, sesame butter, tahini, sesame flour, sesame seed, sunflower butter, and sunflower seed. Most nuts and seeds are neutral foods for your type. However, peanuts, sesame seeds, and sunflower seeds, among others, contain lectins that interfere with your digestion and may increase inflammation. Walnuts have important neuroprotective effects that make them beneficial. My next video is on beans and legumes. I publish my videos on Friday morning at 8 Pacific Standard Time. See you then.